Hi friends, welcome to Ajay Automates channel. In this video, we are going to see the latest interview question asked in EPAM for four plus of years of experience as a full stack developer. So one of our friend attended a full stack developer interview with the EPAM last week. So we got these questions from him. So if you are preparing for development interviews, you can make use of these questions. Please watch the video completely. Okay, let's start. So the interview started with um, the interviewer asked, what will be your primary technology and how many years of experience you have in each technology you have worked. So you have to explain the technology name and the uh, number of years of experience you have in every technology. Okay. Then the interviewer started questions from your primary technology. Suppose you have good knowledge in C sharp, you can tell the interviewer that uh, I have majorly worked in C sharp. So interviewer will ask more questions from C sharp. Okay. And uh, also the interview started by uh, asking us to write some programs okay he, so he shared some logic and we have to write programs for it so here the candidate got questions from array okay you have to find the number of zeros and move the zeros to the end of the array was the first programming question the second question was removing duplicates from an array so you should explain how many ways you know in removing duplicates of an element you can use set you can use loops okay there are multiple ways so you can explain the solutions you are aware of Okay, and the third programming question where, so in the interviewer himself had a program and he asked the output of a program. Okay, this was uh, in inheritance concept. Okay, this was the third programming question. And the other questions were difference between static and sealed class, difference between finalized and dispose, and difference between string and string builder. So my friend's primary technology was C sharp. So basically more questions were asked from C sharp. Okay, and the next uh, section was from Angular. So these are the questions asked in Angular sections, like what are course, what are the lifecycle hooks in Angular component, how are observables different from promises, how to declare a data when it is shared with two or more components, and what are the different ways of data binding, how data flow happens from UI to backend. Okay, so uh, these are the questions asked in Angular. Okay, then. Finally, uh, the questions were asked from .NET SQL and some common question. So from .NET, the questions asked were explain about the MVC, solid principles in .NET and explain about the page lifecycle. Okay, so since it was a full stack developer, basically the questions were asked from almost no, um, all the technologies from front end, back end and UI related. So from back end SQL, uh, query was asked to write to fetch top three values after arranging it in descending order. Okay, you have to arrange values in descending value order and you have to fetch the top three values from a table. And the next one was yeah, explaining about link queue concept and entity framework. So this link queue concept, uh, almost I hear from many candidates, okay, for attending developer interview, experience interviews. Most of the interviews are seeing this question, so be prepared here. Okay, so finally, some common questions asked were uh, how unit test coverage are maintained in your application, how what practice you are doing for improving code quality, etc. Okay, so these are the questions asked during this one and a half an hour interview. So basically, this is a full stack developer role. So almost all the technologies have covered here, front end, back end, and UI related. So if you are preparing for a development interview, please study these questions and make use of our videos okay so thank you thanks for watching so please subscribe my channel ajay automates and watch out for more training videos thank you bye